So I'm down here at Red's place, Red Aikens, the uh, famous country singer. I'm down here at his place. My favorite is to watch Luke do interviews. We booked this right retreat with Randy Montana, one of my dear buddies from day one when I moved to Nashville. Great dude. Turkey cone fool. What is it? Hey everybody, this is Luke Bryan, and welcome to CM welcome CMC to the Farm Tour. I got it. Alright, ready? Yeah. Hey everybody, this is Luke Bryan. Welcome in the farm. Rhett does not believe his farm is covered in turkeys and it's smothered, covered, scattered, chunked, flipped, whipped, you name it. Hey, ma'am, excuse me real quick. You live around here? Um, I don't, but I don't, I don't. You know all about it? You know where we can get some, uh, where we can find some turkeys? Oh no, I don't mess around like that. I'm not, I'm, I don't live here and I don't, I don't know these people like that, but. I mean, we don't want but one or two. Oh no, I don't. Huh? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 You know, you know where we can get some, uh, turkeys? <laughs> <laughs> it's covered in turkeys. Man, you seen any turkeys around here? <laughs> huh? And then you stay to the right, there's another fork immediately after. And going down that road, a lot of times there's some turkeys. Really? Yeah. Game warden bit bad around here? No, not really. There's farms on both sides. Like if we just shot them out the window? Probably wouldn't. Probably wouldn't ever say that. You ever done it? No, I ain't never done it. Oh, yeah. All right, that's what, probably what we're going to do. Thank you. So it's breaking daylight. It's a little bit late. Rip takes us through his honey hole. Turkeys are gobbling their behinds off. So we got up on this fence pole. So he makes two yelps on his box call, tells us it's getting a buggy, the turkeys ain't here, I'm gonna sell this farm. Yeah, there's birds around. <laughs> uh, we make our way back and then he sends us down the road to do some yelping and some calling, to try to get these birds in. And then he decides he's gonna take a nap. It'd be awesome if we hear some turkeys over there. He, uh, chunk your dogs. So he leaves us and we're walking now. We're doing the marathon up the dirt road. Here we are, me, Randy. We're walking down the dirt road, coming to the driveway. There is a blind underneath the playhouse, the tree house, whatever you want it. I don't know what it's called. It has a slide on it and all that stuff, monkey bars. Simply red, red's blind. Oh, hey. He's right there. He's in the Hi, hi. I'm hunting. Hi, hi. He sees one. I thought he was joking. Like a sportscaster. Grant, uh, we have uh, Red Akins in the blind as a. Uh... He just shoot. That hen just like, I just saw wings. Randy, make sure we don't burn the sausage. We see Rhett get out of the blind. He has um, waved the white flag. He has done. So just at the point when I think it's, it's time for some songwriting, Let's ride, let's ride a big one. Rhett decides it's a great time to mow the grass. Looks like Luke and Jason show <laughs> Dude, he put he put diesel in it. He put diesel in it. What does that say? I only went to college for two years and made it for two years, but it says diesel. He goes, go grab that yellow can far up, see what's got in it. What does that say? Diesel. You think this is diesel? 
Well, I mean, I don't know if I'd put. It don't look like. Well, I'm probably just smell it. I'm just saying from now on. Huff, huff that gas. Get all that good stuff on the Diesel. I said, well, the only thing I know to do is probably go get some sea foam and some gas, because he's all of his gas cans were empty. He decides that he's gonna take a nap and send me into town to get the gas and the sea foam. All right, back. Well, okay, sounds great, man. You know, cat now. I know we're wrong. Hey, are y'all are y'all Red Akins fans? You like Red Akins? That's what I figured. Who say y'all? No one knows who Red is. It's awesome. Let's go get this stuff. Uh oh. Bill and Ted just pulled up next. The problem was the gas can was located about 27 foot high up on a shelf and I'm five foot nine in cowboy boots. I can get it, I can get it. Praise Jesus, it's a miracle. Country map me of America. <laughs> What's your last name? Farr. F-A-R-R? -R? Yes. First name? Tyler. G-I-L-E-R? Yep. Alrighty, why'd you put them up so high? They're up there. I had to jump. There's nowhere else to put them. Yeah, that's true. And then you have the final last gasp, which we call the death blow. Oh! Hey, we got it out. We got it out now, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> And that, my friends and children, is how you write a country and western song. So this morning was absolutely freaking awesome. <laughs> There's more goblin than a gobblethon. If that if a gobblethon existed. <laughs> Hit the ground and this is what we hear. Well, I was trying to make sound of a cricket. That's what we heard, crickets.
Oh what? gosh, I see birds gobbling. I struck. Where, where, where? In the bean field. Is, is that, can we hunt that? Is that yes, loose? Yes, we can. I can see them strutting up here in the left corner of this field. Hey, how you yeah. doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, how look. you doing, guys? Butter. <laughs> lucky. Gee, I'm, keep your hands in the vehicle at all times. So we are, we are in full belly crawl formation. I am not where I want to be in physical shape yet. So I am huffing. We're doing the fan. We got the, we got the strutter decoy. I got one, that thing in this hand. I got a gun in this hand. I'm belly crawling. I think I'm a ninja, a turkey ninja warrior. And I'm coming up to this field. I can't hear you. And here comes the Jakes. They come in hot. <laughs> Where is the gobbler? He's not coming. Where's he at, though? Mr. Trevor's a very persistent fellow. Little did I know how long his strides were. And he walks the pace of a cheetah, and I walk the pace of a fire ant. We have a three by three walking convoy of a turkey hunting recon mission going on. And we're going to kill a bird. Saw the birds, didn't know what else to do besides A, sit there and look like idiots. There's birds right there. Is that bush Get him. B, walk up to the thing and shoot it right in the head. thinking about how you weren't you weren't in front of the barrel you're, you were right I know it's loud it was loud I was just loud I'm sorry I was just a three inches the barrel short it's worth it I'll be over here in a few days I don't know I'm excited I look over at old Benny Benny is not excited <laughs> sorry <laughs> I don't even know if we got it on film. I know that we did not got it on film. <laughs> it was like that dad, you know, that says, son, I'm not mad at you. I'm just disappointed. Good shot. He's so mad. My heart dropped to the bottom of my heel of my, my turkey boots. And I thought I was gonna cry. It made me very sad. Oh, we got him. I'm sorry. I'm not. 
Don't Ooh. apologize. I'm happy for you. Let's go see what we got. Let's go check Dude, them out. This thing. It was in the heat of the moment. My heart's thumping like a bunny rabbit's foot. We killed him. He has to weigh about 45 pounds, I'd say. That's a state record. Look at the spurs on that joker. Ooh, look at the spurs on that joker. Son, that is what we call Tennessee gold. Right there. Good one. Heck yeah. Right on. I'm glad it didn't come easy. We didn't want it that easy this morning. Like yeah, you're like, Tyler done. needs to lose. Aldean told me that Tyler needs to lose more yeah. weight. So they're like, he probably called you and he's you like, probably passed hey, make Tyler be belly crawl for at least 250 yards because he's, he's still too fat. You got your cardio today for sure. That was awesome, thanks. You worked your tail off. <sighs> but I think we got it figured out. We sorted it out. We killed a bird. Done. Dead. It was awesome. Makes you want to go straight in a strut. Good stuff. Calms my nerves. Boy, this. I don't know what they're singing about, but I like the way they this say it. Makes me want. <laughs> George Costanza, is that what he said? George Costanza! <laughs> That'd bring a tear to the glass eye right there. <laughs>